What's going on all you ride people? Welcome back to the channel. Solo ride today looking for new trails that possibly got built out here. I have a crude map, but <coughs> it's pretty crude. Uh, so a little hard to find where this might, stuff might be, but uh, we're gonna start with Han. Let's uh, drop in. Tons of grip today. Got rain last night. So no joke. A dude was literally handing out these maps over at the Oasis, and yeah, like, it's a crude map that he had drawn, which hey, is completely Pretty not chilly. to scale at all, obviously, but uh, it made it really difficult to kind of look at this and figure out where any of the trails actually were. So looking at the map, I had at least a rough Dang, idea of where everything was. Whoa. Looking at the map, I could see Dunn Road, and I had Where's an idea of... Climb? what he called the hill to be uh, Haunt, which is the trail I'm on here right now. So I knew if I popped down here, I would at least kind of get an idea of where these new trails were supposed to be. I mean, don't get me wrong, it was really cool that he did this. So, major props to this guy. Whoever he may be. I thought it was low, but I guess I was only a little bit low. I'm not using near enough of my travel. So I think this actually might have been one of my last rides on this bike. Yes, last rides. That means new bike day. So make sure you guys are subscribed, hit that bell icon so you're notified when a new video comes out, and uh, yeah, keep an eye out for it. Yeah, I haven't ridden in a while. Or I've not ridden as much in a while. Definitely not as fit as I was. Ah, oh, man. Love it when we get rain in the desert. Shells are beautiful, tacky, lots of grip. No dust. Can't do by myself, so it's not really a factor, but. <sighs> oh man, I gotta fix my air pressure in my fork. It's way too much. My hands are hurting from it. Uh, like down to the wash, I'll do it. I think I'm gonna make this a full pool video. I think I say it every time, but this is my favorite part of the trail. It's just super fast, flowy, with some nice little jumps that you can hit off. And uh, yeah, just a ton of fun. I think I found the new trails. Something makes sense right now. Uh, trading post sign. Really? It's this way. This is new. Is this new? I don't know if it is. This has been here. Right side looks new, I'm guessing. Maybe coming in the other direction, that'd be a lot more fun, but right now it's kind of boring. Yeah, coming the other way would probably be more fun. But even then, it's just flat. Nothing really out here. I'm gonna turn you guys off. See you, Cat Canyon. All right, you guys, we're at the top of Cat Canyon finally. Those uh, new trails were kind of disappointing, to be honest. 
Maybe going the other way would probably be a bit funner, but nothing too technical. It's all really, it's all really XC-ish. See how this goes. I know I have way too little air in the fork in the rear, sorry, in the rear shock. Let's see how this goes. Didn't think about that. Rain might have had some effect on this thing. <sighs> Holy crap. I haven't done this trail in a while. Trouble not helping me. Lower the seat. Let's do it. Oh God, Whew. lost my balance there for a second. Uh, uh, that would have been bad. One thing about this trail is you have to kind of remember where all the rocks are. Oh, God damn it, Bay Pack. Oh, there's hikers up here. Yeah, they're right there. Hello. Thank you. Yep. Oh, my brakes are warm. 
Well, that's fun. My hands hurt after Cat Canyon. Even with the red grips, that's just, it's an early ride. I gotta redial on my suspension. All right. Well guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit like if you liked it. And uh, drop a comment down below what you think about these, uh, these trails out here. Yeah, it's MTB Ride Dad signing off. I'll see you next time.